So I rolled my hair. It's really because I have a lot of layers in the back. So I'm just going to flat on the front. You know. It's great to be healthy sometimes. Well, most of it. Alrighty. All of this hair. So I always have to flat iron. Not all the time. Like my mama rolls my hair. I don't have to flat iron it. But. No, we want my flat iron. Oh no. There it is. So I was going to have a heart attack. Like, oh no, my laptop went out. And now I'm having issues with the flat iron. It's just not a great. But it came on. So I use coconut oil to just, you know, scalp my, you know, to uh, put a little bit of oil on my hair. Yeah, to put a little bit of oil on my hair so it won't be so dry. I normally grease my scalp with coconut oil or hair food, which, but the problem is with that is, um, it's like my hair eats up everything. It eats grease up all up, whatever. So it is like I can wrap, grease it, wrap it, and then the next day, I have to turn around and do the same shit again. Turn around and do the same shit again. So... I don't know. I just start changing my, um, I just went back to changing my shampoos so I can, um, to see, because shampoo will give your hair moisturizer and different type of stuff. So I was just trying to figure out what it was. So I'm on this different, this moisturizing shampoo from Ion. This smells my hair smells real good. It leaves it real bouncy. I actually like it. I also put a, a ion hair treatment for color hair and relaxed hair like mine because my hair is relaxed. That's why it's, it's so straight because I end up putting a relaxer on there. <clears throat> so, you know. Now, I'm not going to flatter on all of my hair. I'm just going to flatter on the front. I'm going to have some company real quick. Let's see my friend. And this beautiful Friday that God has blessed us. And I just kind of want to look decent enough. Okay. It'll look better tomorrow, people. Look real better tomorrow. I just don't like how my your in, you know how you can get a roller set in your ends or wrap and your ends are so frizzy looking like they didn't dry, like the your hair didn't dry underneath the roller, underneath the hair dryer or whatnot, and I just don't like that. I can't stand frigid ends. Look. Can I stand that? Still look kind of dry, so I'm probably gonna put some more. Oh gosh, some, 
some more oil on here. Give me more oil. Let me get the oil because oil makes it look like that. Oh, I think I put too much on my hands. You see, black people, we have to oil our hair every damn day. You know, it's... um. I be watching how they, the judges and stuff have to wear wigs and um, shows they have to wear wigs. I think that's sad because I think you at least want to try to get to know how to do black people hair like how black people try to get to know how to do white people hair. But then again, I'm not mad because we have different textures in hair as African Americans. And that's what makes us stand out so different, you know. And I just think hair is a beautiful thing of all textures of and race you know from different races i mean you have to understand Just still looks so fucking flat. Especially now. I love how you can see the angle. I think my mom did a great job um, cutting it. She always does. It'll look better tomorrow.